At least 800 cyber attacks targeted Israeli aviation as leaders like U.S. Vice President Mike Pence and Russian President Vladimir Putin touched down on Israeli soil when flying in for the World Holocaust Forum. But thanks to Israel's top tech and security, the attacks coming from Iran, China, North Korea and Poland didn't get through. The goal of these attacks? To disrupt flight paths of more than 60 planes that had very important people on board. Officials here in Israel say they had been expecting this and they're glad they planned accordingly. Just recently, Israel's cabinet chose to place the aviation infrastructure under the protection of the National Cybersecurity Authority, which is a subsidiary of the Prime Minister's office. Reports say control towers and planes have a high risk of danger and that recently hackers have become more successful in causing chaos and devastation by penetrating air traffic computers.